howdy and a big welcome back to Yak City Gaming everybody as once more we're going to pick up the Toronto Blue Jays franchise mode here in MLB 15 the show. So as you know last time we finished up July with that win against Kansas City player locked as Jose Bautista. So here we go we will go to the end of August where we will figure out our 40 man roster and it looks like Chris Abraham is only injured for a few days that's okay. Russell Martin we are going to keep him on the 15 day DL or utilize Abraham and the Yankees want to offer us a trade. What do the Yankees want? Bradley Hansen for Jared Button. Jared Button is 78 overall. Bradley Hansen is a right fielder. What's going on here? 65 overall. Yeah, no, I don't think we're going with that. Because it's the Yankees and it's an inner division trade, and of course, you never know when those will bite you on the back. Uh, activate, perfect. And it looks like we're having a hard time here getting any wins. And that'll be a 15 day DL. 15 day DL. Auto fix rotation down there in AAA. And it looks like we may be in danger of missing the playoffs right now. Because things are not going our way. This was a bad, 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 bad month. And now, to make it worse, Mark Burley's gone for one to two months. Ouch. This just keeps getting worse, guys. It's not going our way. So 71 and 60 now, four games back of the uh, Red Sox, but we're holding down the wild card spot just barely over top of the Athletics. Okay, we need a win, but we need to take a look at the pitching rotation. And you know what, Marco Estrada, get in there, buddy. And it looks like Aaron Sanchez is way leading the way as the starting man now at 85 overall. Dickey is down to 70, so he'll be our fifth man in that rotation, even though he has the most wins out of anyone in the rotation. Miguel Castro has been phenomenal, 70 overall. And what? Castro? You're coming in for Dickey. No, 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 not yet. No, I'm not comfortable doing that yet. Okay. So that'll be that. Lineups are really struggling. Everyone's really cold, so we're going to shuffle up our bottom of our lineup here. And Dalton Pompey has started picking up his pace. Yeah, okay. We're going to have to play this game and see how it goes. Brew Hutchison is our starter. And you know what? We will go with Aaron Sanchez instead. Give him an extra start. And let's go. And I didn't player lock, so guys, we'll actually have to get out of this right away here. Unless I can player lock as somebody in the options, we'll have to see. That's my screw up. I don't know why I do it all the time, but I somehow managed to screw it up every single friggin' time. Damn it. So now I'm only trailing the Red Sox by a ga three and a half games, so we've moved up just a bit. So here we go. Yep, yep, yep. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Sanchez, yep. Okay, okay. And let's go to batting order. How do I do this? Team select. Okay, Blue Jays. Let's try and see if we can do anything here. Nope. Doesn't appear I can, so we will exit game. See how Sanchez does in his extra start. And it looks like the Blue Jays come away with a huge 6 to nothing win as Jose Reyes comes up big time with four RBIs. And it looks like Mr. Aaron Sanchez shut down the Indians with only... Oh, you're kidding. Okay, keep active. That's good. That's good news. He's got a few days to recover. Okay. Let's go into the game where Daniel Norris will be pitching. 
Daniel Norris all ready to go. And we will player lock as Josh Donaldson is who I'm targeting. And Jose Bautista didn't look himself in the cage, so we'll give Kevin Pillar the day. But we'll go Encarnacion, Donaldson, and you know what? Michael Saunders in the five hole. There we go. Okay, we're player locked now. Should be good to go. And we will get ready for this intense battle. Donaldson, the third baseman, he's been having a decent year as a first time Jay. Daniel Norris really needs to step up his game here in September. We're going to have any hope of getting into the playoffs. And look at this right away. Dalton Pompey's on first. And I think that was Edwin Encarnacion there on third. Here we go. Josh Donaldson drives it right into center field. But that's going to be enough to score Dalton Pompey. So Donaldson picks up a sack fly on the one pitch at bat. And that's pretty decent. And here we go, he's at third base looking to turn the double play. Norris on the hill, only giving up probably that one hit, I think. And look at that double play right there. Boom! Josh Donaldson knows what's up. Too easy. Okay, so he's given up two hits, pardon me. As now in the bot or top half of the fourth, Donaldson gets another fielding opportunity here. And Norris on the bump. Pitches, delivers, and Donaldson's nice crouch approach to catch that ball and fire across the diamond for another out. So he gets another plate appearance here to lead off the bottom of the fifth. He's looking for something inside and high, and he's going to get it. He's going to turn, and that one's weird, weird hop, weird hop, and he's going to be out. Can you believe that one? Okay. Sure. Um, wow, that was quite the hop. High and off the pitcher, had that been any lower, I think Donaldson would have been safe. So he takes a ball outside low, and he's really got to get on base here, leading off the bottom half of the seventh. And he swings through a slider way too early on that one. He needs this pitch to be a hit. Oh, and the changeup fools him. Looked like a fastball, but way too late or too early. Pardon me. And he swings way too late on the fastball, and strikes out. Not quite the start you need. And the Jays get one, and then Carnacion's on first in the bottom of the ninth now. So Donaldson really needs a big hit here. He's gonna. Get a high fastball, and there's the hit he needed. Encarnacion will stop at second, and the Jays have two men on with nobody out in the bottom of the ninth as Michael Saunders walks up to the plate, and we'll fast forward to the next appearance as Saunders strikes out. So Devin Travis, the super rookie for the Jays so far this year, 0 for 3 in this game. He needs to step up. Will he do it? He'll strike out as well. So Justin Smoke, 9 home runs. 32 RBI, 225 average. We're going to see, can he deliver? No, the Jays lose 5-2. to two. That'll be all she wrote for the Jays in this one. Guys, I'd like to thank you for tuning in to this edition of the Toronto Blue Jays Franchise Mode. As always, feel free to subscribe. Leave a like on the video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. So long from Yak City.